Welcome to Fantasmapolis X Manila Select Works from the Asian Art Biennial. The Biennial was organized during the COVID-19 pandemic and was presented at the National Taiwan Museum of Fine Arts in Taichung, Taiwan. We were a team of five curators from Asia, led by Taiwanese curators Nobuo Takamori and Ho Yu Kwan. We were also joined by Delhi-based curator Anushka Rajan Grant and Bangkok-based curator Tanabu Chotkadid. We wanted to bring the exhibition to a wider audience, hence this iteration in Manila. We are welcomed to the third floor South Gallery space of the Metropolitan Museum of Manila by a wall announcement of the exhibition title Fantasmapolis alongside pertinent information including the names of participating artists, the members of the curatorial team, and the duration of the exhibition. We will also hear recorded messages from the director of our institution partner, the National Taiwan Museum of Fine Arts in Taichung, Taiwan, as well as the lead curators for the 2021 Asian Art Biennial, Nobuo Takamori and Ho Yu Kwan. In the space of the exhibition, we provided a um, copy of the Biennial exhibition catalog, as well as a QR code which viewers and guests can scan to access. Fantasmapolis draws significantly from the novel by the Beijing-born Taiwanese architect Wang Da Hong. Phantasmagoria, written over several years, chronicles its protagonist's interminable travel across space. He boards a ship that shuttles between two utopic worlds, one where war and suffering do not exist and the other a boundless and fluid universe. The ship does not arrive at any port or landing because it has fallen into the cracks of time. The narrative and the act of writing the novel mirror each other, encapsulating a relationship to time that loops and unravels in equal measure. This exhibition examines the flux of time through an iteration of a biennial project realized during the COVID-19 pandemic. It forwards questions that reframe our understanding of existence across temporalities and locations through the complexities that contemporary art and its platforms can surface. It dynamically stages and eloquently articulates imaginaries of time across visions of an ideal world, as expressed in short-lived events like expositions, the genre of science fiction, the movement of futurism, and the activation of the archive. As such, it becomes a requisite staging of solidarities and a vigorous articulation of imaginaries that situate us in our precarious present. Phantasmapolis confronts questions about the future and its intricate ties to the past. It presents a task rendered eloquently by contemporary art, which asks that we become witnesses of our time in a speculative, reflective, and spirited manner. The archive and contemporary art are two streams that flow through path lines towards futurity or ways of thinking about the future. Contemporary art has embraced archival modalities, as several works in the exhibition would show. The archive project is presented as a mode for thinking along about the future, and is positioned as a lens to contemplate our present, which is probably even more dystopic than any future we have imagined. As a living process, the archive becomes a device that surfaces alternate narratives. Prospecting Archival Documents from the Philippines The archive documents include turn-of-the-century exposition catalogs 
and numerous government reports and articles from the Department of Information. These date from the 1950s to the early 1980s, with emphasis given to articles about housing and greening programs and development projects. The Biennial Exhibition and its components, foremost the archive, are considered transversal sources that simultaneously generate narratives. This approach responds to the inherent task of wrestling with the complexities of documentation and implicating the archival impulse in a generative and enlivening process.